Hello, love the Aptera Trail and the little steps being taken this far to bring the launch edition of its first ever solar EV into fruition. While we await the final production and delivery of the solar EV from Aptera arguably this year, this edition of our briefing covers some developments on the car maker this year this hope will be helpful to those who made reservations of the soon to be produced Aptera Solar. Let's explore this and what has been going on since the start of the year. Let's get started. Earlier this year, Aptera Motors reached a significant milestone by entering the validation phase for its aerodynamic design at Pininfarina's renowned wind tunnel. But before we continue if you're enjoying this content please kindly support this channel by clicking on the like and subscribe button below to subscribe to this channel and to help you to learn of your preferences and enable you to receive new video updates every time they are uploaded on this channel. Thank you. Let's get going. This marks just one part of our comprehensive validation process for our solar electric vehicle. In this update, we're excited to take you through this critical phase, highlighting its importance and outlining the timeline that will guide us towards creating a reliable and safe solar-powered EV before diving into the specifics of the validation phase, let's revisit the development stages that brought us here. These stages include concept and ideation, design and engineering, system development, computational fluid dynamics, CFD, simulation and modeling, prototyping and vehicle dynamics testing, solar testing in low volume production, supplier selection and sourcing, and manufacturing planning. Each of these steps has been crucial in shaping the Aptura vehicle and preparing it for the rigorous validation process ahead. The first key step in the validation phase involves producing the long lead time tools necessary for Aptura's body in carbon, bin C. Over 60% of the essential equipment and tools for creating Aptera's body parts have been completed and commissioned. These tools, which include stamping dies and post-process tooling for forming carbon fiber SMC, are the most capital-intensive and have the longest lead times. Their completion is essential to getting Aptera on the road. Next, we move to the production and validation of parts for Aptera's bents. Using the aforementioned stamping dies and tooling, the body parts for our production intent builds, PI builds, are currently being stamped. These PI builds will look and perform like production vehicles and will be used for further testing and validation. Each body part undergoes a thorough validation process using a coordinate measuring machine CMM, to ensure proper thickness and surface tolerance. Parts that pass this validation process are marked with green stickers and can be used to construct our PI builds. Once all six main body parts are completed and validated, they will be bonded together to form the full bin C. The complete structure will then undergo another validation to ensure the tolerance of the body closures. Following this, we will begin the progress builds and production intent PEI builds. This involves assembling the body parts to create a complete binks, linking the front and rear subframes with a structural battery pack, and integrating this assembly with the bin C. As we incorporate more production intent components, we will ramp up to full PI builds using production parts made with production equipment and tooling. The testing and validation of PI builds then begin, with rigorous assessments focusing on critical components. The suspension and dampers will be tested to optimize ride comfort and handling dynamics. The brake systems will undergo meticulous examination to guarantee precise stopping power. Airbag calibration will be conducted to ensure passenger safety in various scenarios. The thermal system will be tested to maintain optimal operating temperatures for both passengers and systems in diverse climates. The powertrain and battery will undergo extensive trials to evaluate efficiency and durability, and software integration will be fine-tuned to optimize vehicle functions, ensuring a seamless driving experience. Following this, the safety and crash testing of PI builds will commence. This phase includes regulatory compliance checks to ensure adherence to industry standards and quality assurance throughout the validation process to maintain the highest manufacturing standards. Vehicle durability and reliability will be rigorously tested to ensure long-lasting performance and peace of mind for after drivers. Tuning efforts will fine-tune every aspect of the vehicle's design to optimize efficiency and overall safety. These tests will encompass a range of real-world scenarios, reinforcing Aptera's dedication to passenger safety and vehicle integrity. In the manufacturing validation phase, the focus shifts to ensuring that the production of our solar EVs meets the highest standards of efficiency and quality. This involves fine-tuning and testing production equipment and assembly lines to streamline manufacturing processes and optimize precision. By thoroughly evaluating every aspect of our production systems, we are committed to delivering Aptera vehicles that are manufactured with the utmost precision for long-term reliability. Finally, the journey will culminate in the start of production and the commencement of first deliveries. This moment marks the culmination of years of tireless innovation and the beginning of a new era in sustainable mobility.
The first deliveries will be to our 2,000 pioneering accelerators who have supported the start of a brighter, greener, and less destructive future on the road. If you want to be among the first 2,000 after a vehicle owners, there is still time to invest $10,000 or more to secure your spot, which includes commemorative and serialized markings noting the significance of your revolutionary vehicle. Through our diligent validation phase, Aptera aims to deliver a solar electric vehicle that brings us one step closer to making every journey powered by the sun. We hope you'll continue to follow along as we make solar mobility a reality. That's where we wrap things up for the time being. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.